now Take a step outside and seize the day now Hey all and welcome to Lawn Buddy University. Today we're going to be going over our subscription feature. So over in the left-hand column under finances, you're going to notice a new uh, tab called subscriptions. When you click on that, you are headed to the subscription page. And this is our test account, so these names are a bit funky. But the objective of this page is for you to be able to bill your customers on a monthly basis at a set amount instead of per job. So we heard from a lot of our customers that they have customers that no matter how many mows they do, no matter how many times they go to the property, they simply pay a certain amount per month. And they asked us if we could build something that would automate sending those in those invoices. So that's what we did. So we're just going to start by clicking the plus button next to the word subscriptions, selecting a customer. So let's just go ahead and select George, create subscription. And all we need to do is fill this out. So we're going to enter in the name. So we'll just have George's monthly bill. Uh, if I choose to include the past due amount, that just means if there's um, maybe a couple months go by and George hasn't paid his monthly subscription, this will include all of the amounts, all of the um, amount that he owes me if I have this box selected. But for now, we're not going to do that. Let's just say that George, George's subscription is $200 a month. And then I can choose when I want to send it. Do I want these invoices to go out the first, the 15th, or the last day of the month? And let's just go ahead and choose the first for now. And I want to start this on May, in May. And the season ends typically in October. Like, I, I don't go to his, up, his house in November, so I'm going to choose that as the end date. This is for mowing and general landscaping. The customer notes for more info. Thanks, George. It's a pleasure, as always. So internal notes, that means your team just sees them. The external notes, these actually go on the invoice themselves so George can see those. So we want to make sure um, so then you can choose here if you need to skip a month, this is where you would do it. Since you're setting this up to start on the first, you probably don't want to skip it on the first. But say George is, you know, doesn't want you to come out for one month because he can't afford it or something, then you can just come in here and click select skip next invoice. So once we so we can save this, which means it, it doesn't actually start sending anything. It doesn't start and then we can activate it. And once we activate it, we have it right here, George monthly bill, and we can deactivate it if we want, or we can delete it. We can also go in and change the amount if we want. So let's really say, you know, we made a mistake. We actually want it to be 250. Just save it, and you can see that amount there change. So now George um, Brett will be getting monthly emails and text messages that have those subscription invoices in them. So that's how this works on web. Let's go ahead and go over to the phone at the right. And I am going to open up my Lawn Buddy app. And the same thing is now in your app. We just need to navigate over to the finances tab. And at the top, you see we have invoices, subscriptions, and payments. Open the subscriptions and you can see George's monthly bill. This is the one that we just created. So I can actually do everything that I can on web right from my phone. So if you know I'm out at George's property and he tells me, hey, um, I actually don't want you guys to come out next month, I can just go ahead and pause it or deactivate it. And then if I go back into my subscriptions on web, we can see that his account, his subscription is now inactive, inactive. So this is generally how the subscription works. If you guys have any questions, as always, you can let us know. Um, shoot us an email at hello at lombuddy.com. Thank you.